difference, guys, when we're talking about degrees, and it's going to become very important. If you're looking at an angle that's in degrees, we have to include that degree symbol. Otherwise, it's just in radians. So the student didn't show any work over there, but to convert from something in radians to degrees, we need to multiply our angle times 180 degrees over pi. Well, when we multiply this across, um, I'm sorry, we're converting from radians yeah, to degrees. So therefore, when we multiply this, we have 360 degrees divided by pi. Well, unfortunately, if it was in terms of pi, the pi's would have divided out. But in this case, we don't have that luxury. So I'm just going to do 360 divided by pi. <clears throat> and unfortunately, we're going to have to approximate this answer. So it's going to be approximately 114 points. Um, six zero degrees. So you're going to have to approximate with pi. Usually, typically, if it was something in terms of pi, the pi's would divide out. So let's go and take a look at